Welcome everyone, Taylor here with a quick voiceover. The introduction audio was horrendous today. Just want to let you know we went on an impromptu ride to Best Buy. Hope you enjoy. It's a good day for a good ride. Like and subscribe. Let's get on our way. Starting out in Arcadia today. We're gonna drive over to the Duarte Best Buy. I do have a closer Best Buy, but they didn't have the item I wanted, and I wanted it today. I'll just get picking up a cheap pair of headphones for the PS4. We're on the Apollo Ghost today. The 18.2 amp hour battery is the 52 volt version with the standard mechanical brakes that I picked up directly from Apollo. And we'll definitely have plenty of range for the 15 mile round trip. It's just a question of how often I will be able to be in gear two going at the higher speeds. Feeling lazy today, feeling relaxed. Let's just enjoy the ride. nice bike lane yeah, here in Monrovia and it's a nice day out 65 degrees sunny rather cool for a Southern California day you know somebody asked me about my battery management you know when you have more than one scooter perhaps you're not riding them all the time so what do I do to keep my batteries fresh and help promote the longevity of the battery? Well, not much. Honestly, I just, uh, I charge it up full before I use it, either the night before or, you know, an hour or two before. And uh, most of the time during the week, I don't get to ride my scooters. And I make sure to just kind of keep them somewhere around 60 to 70% charged. Uh, I should do an average calculation to see how many charges I have on my Apollo Ghost at this point. I, I imagine it's somewhere around 125 charges. But that is one of the keys to keeping your battery fresh. Uh, don't let it sit completely empty and don't let it sit completely full. You should be good to go. I do expect uh, the technology of batteries to improve. The leaf blower I have seems to have better battery technology than this, and it didn't cost quite as much. Fall colors in uh, Southern California are at a premium right now. Bright reds, yellows, gotta enjoy it. So thinking about what scooter I'm going to get in 2022, the goal is to get a 60 volt system on a scooter. And uh, within that, the minimum I'm looking for is a 28 amp hour battery. Uh, and 
Man, when I'm looking at the Dualtron Thunder 2 with, I believe, what it is, 40 amp hours, man, that looks so cool. That's a 72 volt system. I, I didn't want to skip the 60 volt system. So there's a lot of good rides in there as I worked my way up to getting a 72 volt scooter. Uh, so I have the 48 volt, that's the Fluid Freeride Horizon scooter. The Apollo Ghost here is the 52 volt version of the scooter and I want my next one to be able to put on some decent range. Uh, and so that's why I'm looking for the higher amp hours in the battery. Uh, any suggestions? What do you guys have out there that has that kind of amperage? Uh, something that's 28 amp hours minimum, minimum on a 60 volt system. What, what's good? Tell me below, please. Okay, I'm going to ride down here. I wanted to avoid this road, but it kind of became impossible. I have to use it. Okay, well that was easy. I don't know how you guys feel, but I really feel good just riding down in little quaint downtown areas. Uh, not, not big areas like downtown LA or, you know, San Francisco, but there's something just going through a kind of a, a small feeling town, kind of like how Monrovia makes you feel there. And uh, there's something nice to it. How do you feel? Well, I appreciate y'all joining me for another one today. We're gonna continue on our way home. I hope to see you back next time. Bye now. <laughs>